if you're watching by live stream, you know that God is a gracious God. And I want to tell you, it don't matter how long you've strayed. Yes, like a cardiologist, he healed the broken heart. When you got heart problem, you go to a cardiologist and you say, Doctor, my heart is aching. The doctor will go in and give you an examination. And whatever he finds out, he'll bring you back some good news or some bad news. But our doctor, he has no bad news. All he's got is good news. So he will heal. I said heal. Heal the broken heart. Yeah. Lord have mercy. Like an ophthalmologist who works on your eyes. If you have cataracts or if you have vision problems, you go to an ophthalmologist and you say to him or her, I need you to check my eyes out so I can see. I want to tell you that the greatest ophthalmologist of all time is my Jesus. I heard about a story of a man born blind was brought to Jesus. Jesus, Jesus, he spit on the ground and he take the dirt with a spittle and made some clay and he put it on the man, the blind man eyes. The blind man was able to open up his eyes but he wasn't quite so clear. When Christ got through with him, the blind man said, I can see clearly now. My eyes are open, and I want you to know that's what the blood does. The blood, I said the blood, that give me strength from day to day. But never, I said never, never lose his power. We said that the kingdom of God is built on the foundation of families. How do you know that? Because that's what God started. What he started from the beginning, it was no intentions of his to end it. Amen? It was interrupted, but God uh, sent Christ along to give us the, 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 the opportunity. It's, a, it's an individual decision. Everybody has to make the decision on their own, but everybody can make the decision. Unfortunately, everybody doesn't want to, but we're here because we want to. We're here because we love the Lord, because of what he did in our lives. And so I want to take you to the book of Galatians today, Galatians chapter 3. 